Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Motivation for Young Christians. Welcome back, welcome back. Hope you guys are having a beautiful and amazing day. Today we're going to be talking about how God can turn your trials and tribulation into something beautiful. Something that I've learned from last year and especially this year is that God can turn your hurt, your pain, your trials and tribulation into something beautiful. And God, I've done that so many times in my life because during these last 17 years of my life, I've just been through a lot, a lot of ups, downs, hurt, pain, trauma, trials and tribulation. It's been a lot, but I'm starting to see how a lot of these things became blessings. The perfect example of this is the creation of my channel. From when I arrived in America in 2012 to 2018, I experienced bullying. I did experience bullying while I was living in Ghana, but it wasn't to the extent of how I experienced it in America. Once I came over here, it's like as soon as I came here, it the bullying started. Because of me being new to the environment and me just being different from other people, speaking different, all of that, it just gave them the advantage to bully. And I went through that from first year, fourth grade, all the way to eighth grade. That's about six years. And during that time, it was very hard. We, we're getting spit on, we're getting jumped, we're getting beat up, we're getting pushed down to the floor. And my head getting bruised, the way blood was coming out of my head. Uh, people pulling up to my house to fight me. Uh, the, the hate and all the negativity each and every every single day that I arrived in school. But that six years, it was hard. It was hard, like, it was hard. It was just very hard to endure that. And I had nobody to, to go to that was giving me an encouragement. And then sixth grade, while I was still going through it, I created my channel to be able to be that for somebody, be that um, motivational figure for somebody, be that person that tell them that this it is going to get better. Yeah, you are going to get out of this situation. I wanted to be that for somebody because I didn't have nobody there for me who was doing that. So I wanted to be there for somebody. So the bullying stopped in eighth grade, my second year into YouTube. So I was still making videos, trying to uplift everybody. While I, was, I wasn't good myself, I, I was still feeling all the um, hurt and everything that went along with it. And it, it was just very painful. I went to bed crying a couple of nights, contemplated suicide. Like I was, I, I, I was just pretty much messed up inside of this situation because I just, I was just very hurt. And I was mad at God at the same time because I'm like, God, I'm your son. And these are your people. So why are your people treating me this way? I was so mad about the situation, especially with God. But now I understand why all of that occurred. All that occurred for me to not only help people, for, but for this channel to be created. Even though the creation of this channel, the reason behind it was a painful reason, it was still able to bless other people. These last five years of me making videos from 2015 all the way to now. This year going to make six years. September 27, 2021 will make six years of me doing YouTube. It's just be able to bless a lot of people. I've blessed people with, with joy, happiness, uh, encouragement, laughs, just all the above. I've seen how much this channel has helped so many people. I'm thankful for this situation. But the bullying did turn me into a person that I didn't want to be because after I got out of it, I became that mean, rude, disrespectful person because I was so hurt by every single thing that happened. I said to myself, nobody's going to put me through that. Nobody's going to get me crying, hurt, none of that. I said to myself, whatever I got to do to make sure nobody to put me in back in that area that place that moment in my life i would never let nobody put me back in that moment so i became that really rude aggressive person and i showcased it wherever i'm at i got to fight somebody i got to curse people out whatever i need to do i went ahead and doing it i just became a really mean rude disrespectful person to wherever i went i showcased it even though it was only meant to be showcased in school it ended up showcasing every single, every single way I got into so much trouble. Uh, I heard a lot of people said a lot of mean things and done a lot of messed up things as a result of that. And I uh, just apologize for that situation. I'm learning to forgive myself uh, about that situation. The main reason why I changed and I'm the person I am today is because I no longer wanted to be that person. I no longer wanted to have the bad reputation. Because I had a bad reputation to wherever I went. School, church especially home, I just, I had a really bad reputation and I didn't want that no more. I didn't 
I didn't like getting in trouble. Because just always getting in trouble, being known as the bad kid, it, it wasn't something fun for me. I didn't like it. And I wanted to do right by God. Because I've been going to church my whole life. So I know I wasn't doing right by God. I know I wasn't doing right by his people. I knew it and I wanted to change all of that. And I did. Even though I became that bully, uh, the good thing about that situation is now I understand both standpoints. I know what it's like to be bullied and be the bully. I know both situations and and just other areas and other events and other stuff. I know both sides and I'm able to help people. And I'm able to encourage people uh, through so many things because of my experience. And I'm actually thankful so much for that, that brilliant situation because it will and it has blessed other people. And it's going to take me to places that I can't even imagine. And in Romans chapter 8 verse 28, it says, and we know that all things work together for the good to them that love God. To them who are called according to his purpose. God had a purpose for me way before I was even born. He knew this was going to happen. He knew um, that we're going to birth this channel. He knew every single thing that has happened. I'm just seeing that all things that happen in my life have worked together for the for the greater good of God. Aligning with his purpose. For myself, I want you guys to remember that. Uh, out there, God could turn any bad situation into a blessing in your life. Continue to stay strong, stay motivated each and every single day. Remember the Bible says he will never leave you nor forsake you. Continue to build a relationship with God. Continue to pray. Continue to work and improving yourself. Never stop changing. Never stop evolving. Never stop getting closer to God. This is the end of the video. Subscribe if you're new. Turn on your post notification if you haven't already liked the video. And this is the end of the video. This is Motivation for Young Christians. I'm out, guys. Peace.